How y'all doing, everybody? Today I was answering this tag I was tagged in by Corey Survival. And, uh, I think it's called a six. What's it called again? Serious six tag. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, there was six questions in it. I guess this is going around the community, you know. There were six questions in it anyway. And the questions are, what I fear most in an SHTS situation? And what do you have for currency? Number three is uh, dig in or bug out. And number four is wilderness or urban. Number five is skills I can bring to the table. And number six was uh, three YouTubers under 1,000 subscribers I would bug out with. And uh, I feel like all the answers today. Anyway, let's get to it. Number one, why I fear most in a SHTF situation? That would be something on the long lines of probably economic collapse or social disorder you know they kind of go hand in hand anyway but stuff like that as far as the nuclear stuff you know maybe I guess we all prepare for all that but anyway I always prepare for uh, I guess hard times you know like we did in back in the days you know our forefathers did anything can happen to the economy at any moment who knows you know Anyway, the number two question was a uh, second question. What do you have for currency? I said, uh, I got stuff like a little silver, you know, I got my skills, whatever I got going on. I stash a lot of materials, you know, building materials, stuff like that. Just different kind of things I got uh, for currency, really. A lot of people say stack gold and all that to rebuild, but who can afford that, you know? I got a little bit of gold, but nothing really to talk about. I do, I do uh, stack silver a little bit. It's cheap enough, you know. Anyway, number three was dig in or bug out. And around here, it's kind of both. We pretty much live already at our bug out location, you know. We, we're bugged out already, I guess you could say. So I don't know how much further we can go out here. We got another spot down the road on a... Uh, property and got a old cabin down there too if we had to go down there. I used to hunt out of sometimes and for a little shop and store stuff in but my father and all in laws in that eight nine miles down the road and we got a lot of friends in this area too. But anyway I probably we we're gonna dig in pretty much. Number four, wilderness or urban? And I wanna say wilderness every time. Cause I'm more comfortable out in these woods than anywhere else. You know, no people out here hardly. I mean, the neighbors we do have are all know each other pretty much. You know, a few people got cabins on the lake. They come up every once in a while. That's about it. But definitely wilderness. Number five question was uh, skills I can bring to the table. There's different skills I have. I'm not a master of none of them, you know. But skills I can bring to the table is stuff like fishing, hunting, trapping, you know, I do any, I do that stuff anyway. Metal work, welding, whatever, and a little forging here and there. A little woodwork, you know. Got general homestead knowledge, you know, out here. How to grow food, you know, forge for some stuff. Stuff like that. Number six question is YouTubers under a, with, a, with under a thousand subscribers that I would bug out with. And there's a lot of good people out here in this community, you know. I narrowed it down to three. And one of them's the same person that uh, Corey said, but I followed this guy since day one. He started his channel. And that's Craig over at Haggard Outdoors. You know, he's a he's a younger guy, but he, sure, he knows a lot of stuff, you know, and He's trying to get back to primitive type stuff and 
he's always learning too, you know, and trying new things, which that's a good thing. I definitely take Haggard with me, Haggard Outdoors. Second one's uh, Chris McBee. And, uh, well, I just like Chris. and He's a good guy. I'd definitely take Chris with me any day. Third one is West Wind Survival. I have no idea why these guys are under a thousand subscribers, really. Hello, West Wind Survival. He you know, yeah, he's got a bunch of different skill sets, you know. <clears throat> he's been around, but anyway, I don't say about that. See, so yeah, my three I take with me would, would be uh, Haggard Outdoors, Crispy B, and West Wind Survival. I'm not really going to tag anybody in this today. Cause I don't know who's been tagged, who hasn't. But uh. Yeah, well, my answers are. I tried to cover this the other day <clears throat> out here. Well, I was out in the deer stand out there, but for some reason my sound wasn't on. I had to redo it. I heard this morning looking around. Been so many deer out here this morning. Yeah, everywhere, but of course, when I get a camera out, they're gone. But that's how it is. Anyway, that's my answer to it. Series 6. Uh, I appreciate you including me in this, uh, Corey. Anyway, I'll let y'all go. Everybody have a good one out there. See y'all around.